Why? Why is this happening? Why? <laughs> Can't figure it out? Let me tell you. You see, I was actually chosen by God. I was meant to make this false world real. God? What do you mean, false? <laughs> you see, this is my second time here. Huh? <laughs> Does that surprise you? <laughs> Hilarious! Don't you think it makes sense? I'm the world-famous monarch adventurer! Well, the first time I came here, I had a little help from the terminal. Don't tell me the terminal stone was broken because you've teleported yourself here before? Yep. Sorry, guys. You were so busy celebrating our arrival that I didn't have the heart to tell you. Too bad! This place was always empty. No mythical gods, no oracle, no city, nothing! Except for snarling monsters, of course. So I thought if I jumped higher, I would dive into the sea of stars dazzling in the sky. The true mystical sky capital. I really believed that flapping my wings to take flight, I broke every rib in my body, even choked on my own blood. But I continued to fly. Wanna know what happened next? Suddenly, everything went black. The stars were extinguished like candlelight after a gust of wind. I was lost in empty space. That sky, nothing more than an image. That's when I realized everything in this world is fake. Fake! Isn't that right, Sheena? Well... <laughs> Go on. There's no use hiding it. Odyssea was what I dreamt about since I was a little girl. My life revolved around it. Not only that, but the rest of this world turned out to be a lie, too! <laughs> Isn't that funny? I started to go insane. Before I knew it, I was crying, screaming out as a speck of dust at the edge of the known universe. Huh? Oh, I guess that makes me just like everyone else! Just like everyone else? Remember? The whole story about the buggies stealing our emotions and us going insane? It all makes sense. I've gone rogue before, just like you guys. It was because of that breakdown that Celica, the monarch adventurer, was able to come face to face with God! Why? 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 The real Odyssea has to be beyond this point, right? There... there has to be more! There's supposed to be more than that! This world is... fake. No, that's wrong! I... I, I can't give up! I can't... give... Character sequence collapsing. Character sequence collapsing. This world is all fake! My entire life, my one and only dream! All of my struggles! Lies! All lies! A waste, nothing, void, temporary! I see. Me too. I'm fake too. Interesting. I didn't know NPCs had the capability to puncture a hole in our security field. Who's there? Who? Oh, sweet child. I suppose to you I am god of this world. God. 
HUD? What? That can't be. This world is fake, isn't it? God doesn't exist! Fake? <laughs> I see. You've reached the end, haven't you? Allow me to illuminate you. It is as you suggest. This world is an illusion. However, soon it will become very real. I am going to switch my world with this one. Your world is yours? The real world? That's right. You... you can make this world real? Yes. In order to do that, however, I need someone named Sheena, who lives in your world. Damn it, they've noticed me. Huh? What? What's going on? Listen, it won't be long before I can't make any more contact with this world. If you wish to turn this world into reality, you're going to puncture the hole again, then bring Sheena to me. If anyone gets in your way, exterminate them. Exterminate them? What? When he said puncture the hole, does that mean I've done that before? I... I don't even remember. If you did it once before, then you can do it again, right? If not, this world and you will forever be fakes. <laughs> I will restore prosperity to our people. In order to do that, Sheena, I need you. But that's... that's evil. Celica, we're all friends, aren't we? Real? So all those memories you're seeing in your dreams, is that what the real world is? No, I won't hand Sheena to you. We're in this together. Please, Celica, don't listen to the voices. We can't be fake. You can see us, standing and talking to you, can't you? Celica, this world is not fake. It's a work in progress. I promise you one day, we'll make it real. So, come with us. It's over. If I let the despair take me, it'll be the end of me. So... I'm going to kill you all! Character sequence collapsing. Character sequence collapsing. Is she rogue? Celica! Please! It's us! Shut up. <laughs> Celica, please! Stop! Stop what? The only course of action is to exterminate anyone who dares to stand in my way! I won't lose. My turn. Scanning. All right. Yes! Ready for battle. I'll get him. I want to be stronger. No matter. 
matter how much I despised him or wanted to kill him, I clung to the hope that there was more to life. That's why I continued to sing. I lost my friends, my school, my family, all of it. But my sadness was not for other eyes to see. But even when my dreams came to fruition, I felt empty. No amount of adoration can plug the hole that love leaves behind. Everyone was going to abandon me eventually. If I'm going to lose everyone again, not true. I... I want to be your friend forever. Me too. You've always been my hero, Celica. Celica, I'm here to rescue you. Don't get in my way. My turn. All right. I'll get him. This is good. Take that. Ha! Ha! So long! You Hurry did great! It. End it! Smile! We won! Oh, my <laughs> hands are getting tingly! I should be asking you. I'm so sorry. I think I got too worked up back there. <sighs> Relax. You don't have to be perfect. You're cool the way you are. <laughs> really? I'll take it, I guess. <laughs> Daddy! It's all your fault! Give me back my despair! Yeah! <gasps> I'm so glad. Now that the buggy's learned its lesson, does that mean this case is closed? I'd say so. <sighs> well, time for the long trip back to the temple. Man, I knew I could count on you, Celica. Nothing can stop you. Mm, good. Hey, Lucille. There's nowhere to sleep here. We need to find a safer place. Oh. So sorry for keeping you waiting, guys. Mr. Enigma! Jeez, you could have come sooner, you know. That's sincerest apologies. Huh? Mr. Enigma? Who would have thought she'd be so damn useless? Well, guess I'd expect nothing less from a self-proclaimed world-famous adventurer. What did you say? Where do you get off? Hey, are you really Enigma? Oh, is it that obvious? I was hoping to get more mileage out of this costume. Whatever. Playtime is over. Character sequence collapsing. Character sequence collapsing. <laughs> Celica! What did you do to Celica? Do to her nothing. Just reminding her where her place is. Stand up, you bitch. My word! Is... is this the man who claimed to be God in Celica's memory? I only need Sheena Ninomiya. The rest... I do not dispose of them. Kill! 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 What? Celica! Snap out of it! Step back, Sheena! It's not the buggy this time! Celica's been possessed by someone else! No! You finally saved Celica! It can't end like this! I don't know how much more we can fight! That man, Arata Mizunashi, was it? Codes in such a unique way. He changed the rules of the game. Here we go. Let's change this. Ah, perfect. I simply triggered the program Arata Mizunashi had rigged up. Although I made some slight alterations. 
I can tell Glock took him under his wing for a reason. Huh? How do you know the name of my company's CEO? Who are you? As much as I'd love to answer your question, I'd hate for the Ludens to catch me. I believe you have business elsewhere. <laughs> All that's left is for me to take over your psyche. That way, I can control the Ludens. Why? Why are you doing this? Enough! I told you I'm not taking any more questions. Finish her off! Terminate those who stand in your way! Sequence collapsing. Come on, Celica! Let's go down together! What? That can't be! You bastard!
I'm pretty sure Aphesis has been controlling her the whole time. Mizunashi! Everyone... Everyone is dead! What... What am I supposed to do? I can't deal with this anymore! Hey, stay with me! I understand this is horrible for you right now, but I need you to stay strong, Sheena. You know what comes next. Mizunashi! Listen to me, Sheena. Clea gave her life for you. Not just her, everyone! You will keep going. Initiate the ending engage and return to the real world. But what about everyone else? In theory, they were set to return to their original bodies after I went into the Alice Engine servers. If the ending engage actually happens, they should wake up at the same time as you. Still, we don't know what happened to them. There's a chance that death in World's Odyssey might carry over into reality. That's... How can I... Trust that everything will be okay. I'm not normally religious, but let's pray that the ending engage works like we hope it will. Okay. What choice do we have? All right. You're going to have to defeat Heaven's Messenger on your own. I'll be right behind you, but this is your battle. This might be an impossible challenge. But what chance does it stand against its two creators, right? You and I have the upper hand here. Let's do it! Okay. Sheena, you ready for this? Yes. As ready as I can be. It seems like Aphesis is still controlling the Enigma Avatar. The only way I can assist you is over voice chat. I'm sorry. I'm fine. As long as you stay with me. <laughs> True friendship is always a sight to behold. You're... Rook? What are you doing here? I had to help my favorite patron. I figured you'd like a weapon to aid you against Heaven's Messenger. Really? Thank you so much. Sheena, stop! Huh? So close. As soon as you came close, I was going to stick you in the gut with this dagger. <gasps> you're... You're... Ephesus. So, you've taken over Rook now, too. Ha 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 ha! Exactly! As sharp as you are skinny, Mizunashi. I have Natsuo Munakata to thank. The flash drive connected to Odyssey is still at summer life. Hey, Arida, couldn't you just back up that iris data? Of course, I tried that. I attempted to copy it onto Summer Life's giant HDD, but it didn't let me. Is that even possible? Yeah, it was strange. The crazy thing is, if I leave the iris file on my PC, I can log into Odyssey at any time. That's incredible! Wait, does that mean you could access Odyssey from the PCs at Summer Life too? Well, you can only have one computer logged in per account, so you wouldn't be able to play, but technically you could access it. Oh. Really? Did Ephesus steal the PC from Summer Life? You only have yourself to blame for being so reckless. How does it feel, Mizunashi? Hey, you crook. Why don't you tell me who you are, at least? All I know is you tried to kidnap me and failed. <laughs> you look too nervous to start making demands, boy. You thought you knew everything, didn't you? Mizunashi, I am the executive director of the Imperial Society. Aphesis Lane, Victor Tailman, pleased to meet you. <laughs> if we defeat Heaven's Messenger, Sheena will log out and you'll have no one to play with. What if the Ludens disappear too? Unfortunately, that's impossible. You two could never conquer Heaven's Messenger. Don't underestimate us. Your so-called hacks are nothing. I've already undone your attempt to restore the memories of those stupid girls. What? I mean, 
They're already dead. <laughs> Even if I hadn't undone your code, it would have been for nothing. <laughs> Heaven's Messenger is a special boss that I spent a lot of time buffing. It's something like a child to me. Give up while you can. Let's save both of us our time. Just give me Sheena. Eventually, you'll be locked out of Odyssey for good. The only way to access Odyssey now is with the combination of Nino Mia and Iris. <laughs> oh, don't worry. For Sheena, she'll suffer the same fate as Rook. I only want her mine. However, you can kiss the idea of seeing her alive goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, Victor. If you want someone to do something for you, it's best to act politely. You'd better say please. I'm not asking you, idiot. I'm ordering you. If you refuse, then I can just kill you. Why? Why is Aphesis so adamant about assembling this amalgamized life form? Sheena Nino Mia. Control of the Ludens is control over the entire world. What do you mean? Why did you kill Iris? Was it some sick experiment? Please, return my memories to me! So you're not even going to entertain my offer? Nino Mia. Mizunashi. <laughs> I pity you both. I wanted to make this easy, but so be it. I'll have Heaven's Messenger devour Sheena. We'll just have to extract her mind ourselves. You wish. Time to show you what a real coder can do. Bring it on. Oh. <laughs> Boys love to bark. Like master, like apprentice. my cart down now. Leave it to me, scanning. All right. Hey! See? Hey, yes! It's over! Woo! We won! Leveled up! Thank you. 
All right. We defeated Heaven's Messenger. You did it! <sighs> Thank you so much. Woohoo! That was next level, you guys. No, all credit goes to Sheena for this one. I had no idea you could move so swiftly. I heard voices while I was fighting. It was Lily, Al, Clea, Lucille, and Zelika. They placed their faith in me and made me promise not to give up. <laughs> Throughout the fight, I felt their energy swirl within me. I see. It's a good thing you put it to use then, huh? You were incredible. Oh, at last, you're safe. Everyone! <laughs> Here we go. Showtime. The ending engage seems to be working. All right, it should start just after the credits roll. Mizunashi? Mizunashi! Huh? Um, thank you for everything. <laughs> Don't mention it. I did what anyone else would have done. Thanks anyway. I'm glad it was you. I even cried. <laughs> Getting sentimental? Seems like only yesterday you were berating me for using the bear skin. <laughs> Mizunashi, I find the right to tell you something, yeah? Since I saved the day and all. Uh, uh, wh wh what do you mean? I've missed you. I can't wait to see your face. Oh, same here. <sighs> oh well, guess I'll let them be. And don't worry, we're going to extract your body in the real world. Just relax and try to get some rest. See you soon. Okay. Later. All right, Tokiwa. We're going to Agle. Sheena's waiting for us somewhere in those offices. Let's hurry. You got it. Our original plan was to use a bomb threat to cause a disruption large enough to evacuate their research labs. But... <laughs> Just as the CEO said, looks like they've got their hands full as it is. Look, there's an opening that's been blown open. Let's go! Wait, Tokiwa! Someone's walking out of the building. Huh? I think he's carrying Ren. Tokiwa, let's move. Okay. They used my little sister as collateral. I'm so... I'm so sorry. Either way, there's no room for forgiveness, is there? They showed me a picture of my sister on their prisoner list, but, but my sister was already dead. What was I thinking? Not only did I lose my sister, I even lost you guys. God damn it. Monokata, I'm glad you're alive, man. Ren, I had no idea they kidnapped you and held you captive here. Without Monokata... Who knows what they would have done with you? Exactly. We can't thank you enough for saving Ren. <laughs> well, after all we've been through, that was the least I could have done. I noticed Rin being moved between cells in their underground facility. I puffed up my chest and somehow... I nabbed her. But I'm... I'm a little sleepy. Mind if I close my eyes? Sure. There's an alley behind this building. It's safe there. Take Rin with you, too. Sorry again. <sighs> Rin's still unconscious. I hope she'll wake up soon. Tokiwa, I want you to watch after them. What? You expect to enter that underground facility by yourself? I'm gonna wake up Sheena and then bring her back. It'll be okay. Arda, don't underestimate how big their research facility is. Oh, and take this with you. 
This is an ID card that'll grant you access to some of the locked rooms. I'm no fighter, but I nabbed this too. Wow! Guys... Do you think I'm cool? You bet. Leave the rest to me. Got it. I'll be right here. Don't do anything stupid, okay? Right. Later. Okay. Arida! Hmm? I won't forgive you if I never see you again. Don't worry. I'm coming back with Sheena. Alive. Got it. <laughs>